and innovation. There are new opportunities that change the situation globally, such as the pandemic. At the same time, Greece must support local economy and redefine its position, taking advantage of global opportunities. Greek entrepreneurship is at the first line of this effort, and expert activities can be an opportunity for economic recovery for Greece. Extroversion, the extroversion of the export sector means that it is not affected so much by the crisis compared to other countries. I believe that it is important to highlight the um, impetus of the uh, exports of Greece. In 2019, we had 33.8 billion euros in export compared to 33.5 billion in exports in 2018. So there was an increase of 1%. And if we um, remove boats and uh, mineral oils, there is an even higher increase. In 2020, despite the pandemic, there is a resilience in expert companies. And this creates hopes for the recovery post-COVID-19. According to recent information by Elstat, the total, total value of experts amounted to 22.4 billion euros for the eight months of uh, 2020, and there was a reduction of 1.7%. Without mineral oils, experts have increased 17.5 billion. Only for September 2020, without mineral oils, total exports increased by 6.8%. According to the data, the highest uh, amount percentage of exports is taken by fuels, 22%, followed by fuel, uh, food, 17%, chemicals with 16.3%, and biochemicals, 16.1%. Regarding target market markets, the European Union is still a destination of excellence for uh, Greek products. Uh, exports amount to 56% in 2019, showing that there is a special burden uh, of these markets, a special weight of these mar uh, markets for the Greek trade. We are also focusing on Asia. The middle class will amount to 3.5 billion people in 2030. Apart from China and India, Indonesia, uh, B uh, Vietnam and Thailand are growing. There are also great perspectives for Africa. Apart from Nigeria and South Africa, we see that there is also growth in countries like Ghana, Tanzania and Ethiopia. Allow me to mention the very important work of the Greek economic diplomacy. Under the auspices of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, its activities have been reinforced. In 2020, we managed to assure the sanitary material that Greece needed in order to address the first wave of the coronavirus. This was a very difficult period where all countries were competing with no rules, with no single policies over the limited personal protection equipment for citizens and um, the uh, healthcare staff. So, this model will contribute to a single strategy for promoting experts and we should take other measures, the economic diplomacy, has to do with energy and energy sufficiency in Greece, the supply chain by improving railroad and road connections with our neighborhood, establishing customs controls uh, at the borders, creating joint actions through culture, uh, helping startups through the strategic dialogue with the US, and a dialogue and bilateral relations with Germany. We are also focusing on the investment funds of a series of countries we uh, collaborate with in order to create the right conditions for financing investments in Greece. At the same time, Enterprise Greece and the uh, credit insurance organization are being restructured in order to serve extroversy. Mr. Alexandropoulou mentioned that Enterprise Greece 
is using new tools such as digital events, B2B meetings, webinars and other tools. We are also preparing for the post-COVID uh, era. We are restructured and our new export promotion structure aims to provide more support to uh, Greek export companies and to promote high quality Greek products, therefore improving the brand name of Greece as a whole. Export businesses must address a new reality. There have been many cancellations of, uh, expo of uh, expositions and other events. All this is replaced by online events, networking, uh, online networking and other tools. We are proceeding to online transformation, a digital transformation of our solutions. We will create electronic lists of export products. Yes, you can talk about this later, Mr. smith lease because you uh, can answer some questions afterwards. The most important thing that we can draw as a conclusion from what you said is that Enterprise Greece and yourself as a general secretary are playing an important part. Now let's move to the second. Excuse me, please allow me to say a few words just to close my intervention. Just give me one minute. Yes, of course. Enterprise Greece uses all these tools and many other tools that I can mention afterwards. I would like to say that the uh, Expert Credit Insurance Organization is being restructured and is ready to provide new products, uh, credit products. The aim is to have competitive terms that will improve the competitiveness of uh, businesses. Mr. Stamatopoulos will talk about this later in detail. I would also like to ensure that the economic diplomacy of Greece is already planning its, nuts, its future steps and we are committed towards expert companies that we will help them approach traditional and new markets, thus reinforcing sustainable development of the Greek economy. So we have a new structure under the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and an overall strategic planning and in collaboration with ministries and other bodies. So in the post-COVID era, we want to provide to our exporters the help, we need, the help they need in order to make them competitive and pioneers when markets will open in 2021. Thank you. Thank you. Now I will give the floor to Mr. Stamatopoulos. General Director of the uh, Export Credit Insurance Organization. Mr. Matopoulos, you have the floor. Thank you very much, Mr. Zoys. Um, good evening. have that time here with, I, with you. The leadership of the ministry has already um, sent my speech, but I'm going to uh, Change it for a, a, a little. So it's an honor for me to be here. Uh, the um, insur credit insurance um, uh, organization is a, an international, uh, an internationally called expert credit and agency. We want to provide guarantee in financing our products. The organization right now is um, ensuring uh, risks of non-payment from commercial and political risks as well. We have a capital, a guarantee capital amount to 1.47 billion euros. We assist SMEs and micro enterprises that are 95% of businesses in Greece. We also provide customized programs for um, SMEs. In collaboration with the banking sector, we provide the ability of an easier and cheaper financing for uh, companies and especially startups. Experts are facing important challenges due to global tensions and the pandemic. Economic uncertainty is increasing and the insolvency of companies is increasing. According to Bern Union, Right now, the vulnerable sectors are transport, uh, retail trade, and construction. 
other organizations in the OECD countries have high demand for insurance uh, in Germany, in Spain. So there was an increase of around 10 percent. In these difficult times, the organization stood by export, uh, exporters. In many cases, we increased our uh, offers uh, under the same policy. As the minister, the uh, deputy minister and the general secretary mentioned, the new administration and the BOD of the organization aims, first of all, to reform the organization, a reform that has started for nine months now. We have taken as an example the Italian uh, organization that has also prepared a study for our reorganization. This organization is called SACE that applies a series of models and a portfolio of products. In collaboration with Deloitte, we have prepared a five-year business plan. What I would like to say, closing, is that 2021 will be the year where the organization will create new products for businesses and where the new business plan will be applied so that we may be able to respond to the needs of the future, focusing on digitization and sustainable growth. We want our organization to play an important role in stimulating financing from the private sector. It is an urgent need that our organization may become a pillar of the uh, Greek economy when it comes to the export strategy of Greece and the increase of the GDP. Thank you very much. And I hope I did not take too much of your time. Thank you. Thank you for your presentation. Now I would like to give the floor to Maria Papazarkada, country manager, Greece and Cyprus of COFAS, Greece. Exporters play an important part because uh, you actually assist exporters because you protect them from risks around the world. You have the floor. Thank you. I would like to thank the president for inviting me here and for allowing me to present this product and our views. Allow me to say a few words about who we are and what we do as a company. Mr. Stamatopoulos mentioned some things about uh, credit insurance. I would like to take things one, st one uh, step further. We want to have secured the export credits, but also the, na the local domestic infrastructures and uh, transactions. So this will offer a broader scope of complementary or even separate instruments that will support exports. Coface is a multinational company listed in the French stock market with more than 70 years experience, present in 200 countries with uh, more than 200 countries with customers. It uh, cooperates uh, with its customers aiming at uh, the development of sales via innovative pro products that are re developed, tailor-made for every customer. There is no similar or identical uh, contracts in COFAS. We also offer services of financial information that can uh, be a complementary to contracts. I would like to focus on this because we emphasize the full integrated and uh, updated information base so that in so we cooperate with specific companies information companies and data companies so that we can have the best uh, information in all cases in the greek market we have done this by investing in ICAP. We provide the 
investors the opportunity to know everything about the foreign market. We have very good uh, access uh, to economic analysts uh, all over the world. So the Greek investor can know everything that is necessary for a successful product and a, and a successful expansion. Their expansion to new to new markets will give us the opportunity, give them the opportunity for better competitiveness. In our own profession, in order to support the extorsi, we have six products. The basic one is. Uh, credit uh, insurance, information, as we mentioned, and of course, collection of uh, bad debts all over the world, and of course, for free, if, as long as they are insured. Or we can also insure a single transaction or a single project or a single customer. We have a uh, contracts in various countries through factoring, for example, for Germany or Poland, for example, and we also can ensure uh, risk. Via credit insurance, an exporter is not limited in a foreign country, but they can ensure advanced payment to suppliers so that they can lose none of, they can't lose any money and at the same time they know very well which is the credit credit credibility of their partners no matter which are the practices or uh, customary habits of the other party so the greek exporter has another has a advantage against uh, the foreign uh, procure because they have invested in their investment in their um, project from the beginning and they are not going to face the Pareto risks so the value can increase if uh, their if the the strategy is set from the beginning we can also ensure single transactions with a, a very flexible premiums. We can also ensure any conflict in the case that a customer doubts the quality or quantity of uh, the product received or the pro service received. We can also ensure transport costs, uh, packaging material, any penal clauses, uh, natural disasters in the case that the customer cannot uh, pay due to force majeure or for uh, as a flood, for example, etc. They can also have a specific uh, credit limit. In order for the exporter to take advantage of these uh, products, they do not need to, to have their own risk monitoring tools. By ensuring their credits, the insurer offers such tools, and it is the insurer who provides knowledge, experience, and management for the credit of for every credit of the customer, supporting the customer's work and assisting them in face of uh, the unknown uh, future. Reimbursements are ensured and the clientele is uh, happy for all claims. At the end of the day, they insure the exporter has better margins for profit, is competitive, knows very well who are the other parties, who are the buyers, improves their budget, ensures their claims, and protects their liquidity against the very flexible collaterals. In conclusion, let me say what people ask me. 
whether pandemic influences uh, the insurances of credits or any other kind of uh, similar events. I am going to speak in English and give this answer. This is business as usual for us. Thank you. I would like to thank Mrs. Papazarkada. Just a couple of times, a couple of minutes for a discussion. I would like to apologize to Mrs. Milis uh, for the short time. After the pandemic, we expect that uh, business is going to come back. Um, Mrs. Mislis, you spoke to us about Enterprise Greece. Uh, can you give us some more details? Enterprise Greece, from the beginning of the pandemic, moved quickly. So we had uh, some electronic platforms uh, that, from the beginning, that uh, managed to replace the B2B uh, traditional ways. So we managed to support Greek supporters uh, per sector by organizing conferences and forums that were complemented with specific meetings. So our exporters would come uh, closer to each other and closer to the customers. That's how we managed to gain time, the time that we had, lo had lost due to the pandemic. Our aim through the Enterprise Greece and through the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, we are going to support uh, more. We want to gain time and we want to be updated. In between meetings, you can take advantage of the seminars that we offer so as to be ready when you meet the other party for the contract to be signed. I would like to thank you, Mr. Stamatopoulos. I see many questions related to insurance. What are we expecting in 2021? Unfortunately, we need to have uh, some discussions at the level of ministry first. So I'm not in the position to speak about the new products uh, that can be launched in 2021. So please be patient. In a few weeks, uh, you, uh, the plan is going to be published. So, Ms. Papazarkada, from your experience, how easy it is for Greek exporters to understand that they, you are their part, you are their ally, you're not supporting any foreign product. You we know very well that in Greece, people are suspicious sometimes. How are you going to deal with this in the future? Let me just say that we had difficulties 20 years ago when uh, I started working with, uh, with this, uh, in this uh, job. It was very difficult then to convince the Greek entrepreneurs that this is a development tool. We need to see that uh, we have to be in pace uh, with the international partners. We have to see what happens uh, with our colleagues, and we have to see what happens with the reimbursements that have taken place. We can give this kind of examples, or we can see what happens in other companies where they have similar products. So. When this information is very valuable for the Greek entrepreneurs because they, by knowing these things, the entrepreneurs want to be to partner with us. In my 20 years of uh, in this company, 
no, we had no customer that would uh, stop their contract. They all knew how valuable these these uh, insurances are. Thank you, Mrs. Barbazarcada. We don't have uh, time for any further questions. We have to close. Just one last phrase. As the General Secretary of the Ministry about OIP, the new products have started being planned based on the needs of uh, the questioners, actually, the exporters who pose the questions, because we know their needs, and we have recorded them, and very soon you'll know which are these products. So the needs of the market was our um, our compass. Thank you very much for being here. I would like to thank you, Mr. Ms. Lee, Secretary General for Economic Diplomacy and Operation Openness, Grigori Sabatopoulos, General Manager for Expert Credit Institute and Organization, and Mrs. Maria Pavazarcada, Country Manager, Christian Cyprus, Compagnie Française d'Assurance pour le Commerce Extérieur, COFAS Greek Branch. A short break now. Let me say to all the participants that you can uh, see our, the sponsors, sponsors on the landing page of the site. Short break, back together. Λάδι, μέλι, κρασί, προϊόντα της ελληνικής γης και των ανθρώπων της. Εκείνων που δουλεύουν για να φτιάξουν κάτι μοναδικό που αξίζει να φτάσει σε όλο τον κόσμο. Στη Eurobank στηρίζουμε στην πράξη την εξωστρέφεια. Σε συνεργασία με 14 διεθνείς τραπεζικούς ομίλους, φέρνουμε σε επαφή τους Έλληνες εξαγωγείς με πάνω από 12.000 επιχειρήσεις από 50 χώρες. Με επιχειρηματικές συναντήσεις σε όλη την Ελλάδα, αλλά και διαδικτυακά. Μέσω του Trade Club Alliance, του πρώτου παγκόσμιου δικτύου επιχειρηματικής διασύνδεσης. Προτεραιότητα στην ελληνική επιχειρηματικότητα. Προτεραιότητα σε εσένα. Eurobank. I would say to young girls, be yourself, trust yourself, and persuade the dream. And you will create the dream that you want to follow.